So today I'm going to be showing you the easiest way to win as the New Republic in Star Wars Squadrons Fleet Battle Online. You're going to want to run two different ships with ion torpedoes or missiles. They come in very handy for destroying enemy shields. And since you're the New Republic, it's important to have components that increase your shield or your shield regeneration rate because you will be taking a beating from the Imperial Star Destroyer and cruisers. So the match begins with a head-to-head -head dogfight between players and their cruisers. It is important that you win this dogfight. Once you win, you'll notice the bar at the top push towards the enemy side. That is buying you more time to attack enemy ships. As soon as you can attack the first wave of destroyers, let them have it with everything you have because these ships do not regenerate shields. Whenever you see a ship with a green health bar on the top half, that means it has shields, and this is when the ion cannons can take down those shields very easily. Now the way to finish this game in one move is to destroy as many player and AI ships possible while also healing your teammates. If you stay alive and the enemy keeps dying, the bar will keep pushing to their side and will prolong your single attack. It won't be long before the main Star Destroyer is available to be attacked and what you want to do is hit this Star Destroyer with as many ion missiles and torpedoes possible. Knocking down the shield on the Star Destroyer opens up the availability to destroy its shield generators on the top of the bridge here. All the while, your team must not forget the most important thing, and that is to destroy AI ships flying around the map. And don't forget guys, if this video helped you at all, just drop a quick like at the bottom for me. I appreciate it so much. Remember how I said ion cannons were good for destroying shields? Well, proton cannons are good for damaging hulls. Once the enemy destroyer health is low enough, your team can swap to a couple of bombers or X-wings with proton cannons and make one final pass to destroy the destroyer. If you enjoyed this video, be sure to check out the stream every day here on YouTube at 8 p.m. Central Time. We'll be getting into some ranked fleet battles, so it's going to be pretty exciting over the next couple weeks.